Hello, in this specific video, you're going to learn how to add HTML code to the post or page editor tab. So let's go ahead and get started. Now, whether you use HTML frequently or you've never used HTML code in your life, this video can really help you in the future because eventually you're probably going to encounter some sort of HTML code that you will have to enter into your WordPress post or page. So to help you understand you know, how to do all of this, I'm going to suggest to you a free HTML editing tool. You don't need to know any type of web coding or any technical skills to do this. All you have to do is simply download a free program. And if you've used Microsoft Word in the past, then it's as simple as using that word processing tool. So I'm going to go to google.com here and I want you to type in K-O-M-P-O-Z-E-R and that's the name of the software and it's K-O-M-P-O-Z-E-R dot net. If you click on downloads, you'll notice that it is compatible with Windows, Macs and Linux. So it doesn't matter what operating system you use, it is available to everyone. And that's what I like about it. And not only that, it's really, really easy to use. So go ahead, download it and install it. Now let's go back to the WordPress dashboard here and we're going to create a post. So I'm going to go under posts and click on add new. I'm going to enter the title and you'll notice that there are two tabs here. There's a visual tab and there is a text tab. The text tab is where you're going to enter your HTML code. Now, the reason why I suggested the HTML composer web editing tool is if you ever want to use it to you know, do anything quick and easy, you can actually do that. So if I go ahead and open this up here, uh, this is what composer looks like. And let's say we can do something really simple and easy and we want to format it and this and that. So I'm going to enter a quick article here. Okay, so for the headline, I put, how would you like to edit HTML pages without having to know a single line of code? In this article, I'm going to show you just that. So let's say, for example, that this is, I'm going to bold this, I'm going to italicize it, I'm going to underline it, and I am going to uh, change the color to, let's say, red. And let's say here, I'm going to change the color of this to something like blue. Now, in a typical article, you may not necessarily want to do this because uh, it does not necessarily look uh, really professional, but I wanted to show you this as an example. So if you click on source, we're basically looking at the HTML code here. So in this example, what you would do is anything in the body from the body tag to this tag. You just copy this information and simply paste it here. Click on publish. And if we click on visual, we would be able to actually see it. So it's actually just a very, very fast way to you know, format your text really, really fast. But you'd simply enter the HTML code in here and we can view it after we have updated it. So click on view post and there we go. So to me, that's just a faster way of formatting my text and uh, doing that versus, you know, going here using the editor and you can use the editor. That's fine. But I wanted to show you this simply because if you had other information like other HTML code, then simply enter it under the text tab and you're pretty much good to go. And I wanted to show you the other stuff simply because if you ever wanted to do that, that is an option for you. 
Now, before I end this video, I do want to say that anytime you get some sort of HTML code from a site or anything like that, and they ask you to add the HTML code to a post or page or anything like that, then all you have to do is click on text, enter the HTML code here, simply as I showed you just now, and that's it. And don't forget to click on update and you're good to go.